Lisa. I'm a pastry cook and a video blogger, and I work at Momofuku Milk Bar in Brooklyn, New York. I'm here to tell you about my amazing summer externship experience, thanks to none other than David Chang. He offers the opportunity to apply for a summer and winter scholarship. You can say, hey, I want to learn about this, or hey, I want to go to this place and you just type up a proposal and maybe you'll get picked. That happened to me and that's why I'm here to show you this video of my bread baking adventures in Michigan. Let's get right to it. My summer began in Ann Arbor, Michigan. Zingerman's is not only a bakery, but a deli and a restaurant and a major source for shipping delicious treats across the nation. So let's go right into that production kitchen and I'll show you how the bread's made. So I would spend the first part of my day learning about the mixing process with Amy. You know what rye chops are? Let me tell you about them. Rye chops are used to make the Zingerman's rye dough. Whole loaves of rye bread are thrown into the mixer with water and they break down into a paste. Every time you have a loaf of that rye bread, there's a little bit of the last loaf in it. After I learned all about mixing, I learned all about shaping, so I went to the bench. I learned how to shape rounds and baguettes, the tards, bagels. Zingerman's makes their bagels the old-fashioned, traditional way. First, they go into the kettle. Then they're fished out and thrown onto the boards. And then they rotate in an oven for about 20 minutes until they're baked. What's better than a fresh bagel? Now it's time to boogie on down to Detroit, where I worked at Avalon International Breads. A bread-focused bakery that is committed to a simple three-fold mission, earth, community, employees. All of the bread at Avalon is made with 100% organic flour. This makes for a unique and flavorful loaf, but also trickier to work with dough. And I'm tuning in to your cardinal sin, sick in moonlight. And I spent the last two days at the ovens with George. He did most of the loading, but I did watch and learn. I had my bread internships and I couldn't get enough of Michigan because I love it because I'm from there. You see, my good friend Zoe, her dad owns this jam company. They make delicious jams that are sold across the country, including at Avalon and at Zingerman's. So I went up there and enjoyed just a perfect Northern Michigan day. I got to go to the production kitchen and see the cooks busy at work making sour cherry mustard. Okay, so that was really it. I had an awesome time. I learned a really good foundation of bread making skills and met a variety of wonderful, hardworking people. 